I'm Walt Medlock with Advantech, and I'm here to tell you about our Profinet demo panel. Uh, we are demoing our Profinet Remote I.O. as well as our WebOP HMI product. And the hardware that we have on this panel, we have a Siemens controller. This is a small PLC, and it's connected to an Atom 6117 PN, which is daisy chained to an Atom 6160 PN which is daisy chain to an Apex 5071 Profinet coupler, which is finally daisy chained to the WebOP 2070T. Now, in this demo, we have the controller which controls the I.O. on all of these remote I.O.s, and then the HMI panel which is connected through the daisy chain back to the Siemens controller. And uh, in this demo, we're showing that with our daisy chain capability, we don't have to sell an extra switch to go along with it, although that would always be an option. The, uh, the Atom 6117 is connected to an analog, it's an analog input that's connected to this position sensor. It's an inf infrared position sensor, and it will read position like your hand or a piece of white paper. The white paper works a little better, which I'll show in a minute. The Atom 6160 is a relay output, and uh, we'll show that in the demo as well. Finally, we have the Apex 5071, which is running some remote I.O., as you can probably see the lights flickering. And also, we're showing on this back plane here that it's separated and connected underneath with an Ethernet cable. Now, even though it's connected with an Ethernet cable, it's still treated as part of the backplane. So this, uh, this setup can work either way, and the customer wouldn't have to do any additional steps to set it up. So finally, with the uh, demo software on the HMI, we, it sh starts up with three buttons on the top. One says demo instructions, one says software demo, one says live demo. If you're still unsure how the, the demo works, this panel, then you click on Demo Instructions, and it'll show different pages that explain each of the pieces, and you can click on the tabs at the top to go through each of the pages to understand what the demo is doing. And you can hit the Home to go back. The software demo, it shows different aspects of the WebOP software that you can demo how that software works, and like there's a photo on there to show how good the screen looks on the WebOP. People really like that as well. And if you go back home, finally there's the live demo which shows everything on this demo panel all in one screen and shows some live I.O. And now we'll zoom in a little bit to show what the, what the software looks like. So to show you the software demo, if you push the demo instructions, each tab at the top there's an overview, uh, there's one for each of the modules on here. Each tab will switch to a different, and most of the I.O. or the demo parts are live and they'll show you actual data and they still work. But if you want to see it all on one screen, you can hit the live demo and this is uh, the, the analog input from the 6117. Now if I hold a piece of white paper up to that sensor, you'll see that the analog value changes. It works a lot better than using your hand because the white reflects better for the infrared light. And then for the 6160, you simply just touch the buttons. While there's no lights on the 6160, you'll hear the relays click on and off. And then finally, you have the different slots for the APACs and you can stop them and you'll see the I.O. below stop and then you can start them running again or you can reset the count. And then there's also relay outputs on the Siemens controller that can be controlled through this. So that's a, a look at the software on the WebOP that goes along with this demo. And as I said again, there's plenty of instructions on this demo to walk you through each of the pieces and it explains it quite a bit in case anybody wants to uh, see what's, uh, what's up with the demo. If you have any further questions on this demo, I can be contacted at extension 330 at any time to help explain.